hi everyone welcome back to my channel today i'm going to do first to 15th of march for virgos before starting subscribe to my channel follow me on instagram for more updates for personal readings you can contact me on instagram or whatsapp me details are given below now sun moon rising and venus signs and virgos first of 15th of march what's going to happen with you Mind that this is a general reading, so everything may or may not resonate. Personal readings are always there to help you. Virgos, whoa, you're feeling very attractive or there's so many people attracted to you. Okay, so I do see like someone wants to marry you or is offering you commitment long term. Okay, like that. They want to be with you, uh, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. They're not leaving you. They're not letting you go. This person is heavily attracted to you. I feel like they want to spend their life. Virgos, you're feeling confused. You're like, what should I do? Because you're confused. You may not feel the same for this person. Okay, maybe you have more than one option and you're simply focused on your work, on your job, on your career. And so you have no time for this. But I do feel like there's someone who's heavily, heavily attracted to you and want something more in this connection i do see this is a uh, one from your friend circle maybe more than one people interested in you i feel like people talk a lot about you in good uh you know uh light people think good about you you may not know that the people around are very appreciative of you but you don't know that i feel like you're avoiding this person they may be trying to get to know you through your friends you guys may have mutual friends or they may be contacting your friends to get to you. I feel like you may have rejected this person recently, but they're still like, they're not talking to you, but they may be talking to your friends to get to you. And I feel like they feel heavily rejected by you. There's been a failure in this connection recently. I feel they're going to still retry. This person is going to give it slow try, but they're definitely going to retry. I feel they felt a heavy failure in this connection, maybe because... You ended this connection, something was missing, maybe they were doing some third party tricks with you and you didn't know, you, you came to know about this later on and then it all ended. But this person is willing to come back into your life again, they're going to make every effort to get you in their life. I feel this person is highly attracted. The best part about you that they think is that you are very independent you have everything in place money is good the way you look everything is just perfect about you that's how they feel and they know that they cannot get anyone else and the best thing also they feel like this effort that's required you're not easy to get okay and you're a perfect man or a woman whoever it is okay so that's why they're highly attracted to you i feel like they're ready to work on this connection like harder and I feel this is going to be harder for them this time, but still they're going to work on it. I feel like you're very work-oriented. A Virgos, maybe you love your work a lot. And you do have feelings for this person, but you're not opening up because once ended, you're like, it's all done. But I feel like you do have those feelings for this person, but you're not revealing them. I feel like you're investing all of your energy into work. This is how you're trying to forget this person. But I feel they are still trying to, you know, uh, make you open up your emotions. Or they're trying to reveal, make you reveal your emotions by saying such things. Okay, I feel this person keeps a uh, tab on you. They keep think, uh, like they keep checking what's going on in your life. They may also be um, following you or f you know meeting you at the random places and talking to you, you know, like that. I do feel this person is watching your every move. They know they know that you have feelings and you're holding them and you're not letting them know and you're trying to move on but this person is still holding on to you. I feel like this person feels it's a heavy work but then they are committed to it. Okay. Yes, this this person is stalking you and then not letting you go. They're holding on, they're stopping you from moving on, but I feel like you want fairness. You don't you're not looking for something 
fishy here you want something very solid and this person failed to do so so you decided to move on even though it's difficult Virgos but you're trying this person is not liking it and they're holding on they're stopping you your every move to finish this okay so I feel like you're looking for justice you're looking for fair game you feel like if this person has wronged you they will wrong you again so you're you want fair game. So this person knows this, but they're still going to try on this connection. Playfulness. This person is kind of a player, okay? They do play around behind your back or they have that kind of energy in them. That's what you don't like. New love. I do see a new person coming into your life. There's a very high chance of new love that's coming into your life okay because i told you that you're the center of attraction like more than one people may be interested in you for long term i do see chemistry here okay i do see someone is gonna be very playful with you in the beginning and you know make you feel light and i feel the best part about you that this person will like is that you'll love yourself i do see um whoever it is past or new person Everybody is going to make efforts towards winning you over. I do see marriage coming in for Virgos very strongly. <coughs> At least a long term, someone is going to look for it. It depends upon you, who you want, who you don't want. Okay. So I do see like people are going to make efforts for you. There is new love around. I feel you need to accept certain flaws in the other person. There's a little bit of adjustment or maybe more required <coughs> in some cases. Okay, certain things that you need to accept of this person and that you cannot change because otherwise your health is getting affected by whatever happened recently with you. You need to accept that th certain things you cannot change. I feel like there's going to be a lot of excitement in your life where someone uh, who cracks a lot of joke, jokes is going to come towards you. Growth. I do see your connection with someone growing in future look out for that okay and i do see a lot of confidence building up into you in your personal energy in your personal health you know building up of that nothing will come out of this situation i feel like maybe the past will try to re-enter in your life a lot of times but you have to realize that nothing's going to come out because they always make you feel empty a tough cycle is going to end with a capricorn maybe because they left you feeling empty somewhere so i feel like you've decided to end a tough cycle because there's someone new that's entering into your life climax is coming where you're going to end up into a big fight and there, there's going to be either yes or no but i see more so on the side of no I feel like this person could be in Aries that's coming your way, okay? There's an ending with one person and opening up in new love with a new person. I feel you need a lot of energy healing. Meditation will help you. Or taking a guidance from an energy healer will heal you. Your chakras need to heal. For that, you need to first of all let go of something that you can't change, that you cannot change. So you have to accept the truth and move on, walk away from situations learn to do that and i feel you need to walk barefoot on the grass this that's going to really heal you okay not for you someone here is not for you okay maybe there's someone from the past who's trying to reconnect with you a virgos after making a uh, fallout with you after ending a situation with you and i feel like they are asking you take them back but uh, that's not the person for you. Or you may be thinking about someone. Maybe this is a person. No, they're not the one for you. You have to understand that. Heal yourself. I feel like tarot reading may heal you. Watching these situations may heal you. Have a purpose in life. Okay, You need to follow those. Feel what's inside you that you need to bring that out. Because I do see you have a lot of talent, Virgo. That you really need to bring that out in the world. Because you will be renowned for something or you're going to grow your career very well. Your wishes are going to be fulfilled. Some of you getting name, fame, uh, higher status in society, uh, admiration. And I do see many people are going to see you as wish fulfillment. So I do see you getting married as well. If you're looking for marriage, that's happening. Whatever wish you've sincerely had from a long time, it's going to be fulfilled. Doesn't mean that you go back to the person who hurt you in the past. 
right now you really need to heal your energy you will need to balance yourself because that's how you're going to go further in life so that is a reading for you Virgos. i hope you've enjoyed it and if you did do not forget to like this video subscribe to my channel hit the bell and comment down below bye